Wagner is live at the U of A campus where the painting has just returned in brick. Again, this is a fascinating story. It's one of the most interesting stories I've covered, Valerie. And yes, it is a difficult day here at the University of Arizona. And this does not minimize that by any stretch, but it is a bright spot here on the university campus. Woman Ochre, back where she belongs, on the wall at the University of Arizona Museum of Art. It has been a long road. As you said, this all started in 1985 when a couple came into the museum. They came in early. The man went upstairs. The woman talked up a guard and they were gone, had left in a sports car before the guards were able to realize that woman ochre had been violently slashed from her frame at the University of Arizona Museum of Art. Um, and generosity of these individuals, of people just doing the right thing because it's the right thing to do, is the story that I think we all need right now. So it's not just painting on a canvas, it's an incredible story. And now a little background on the piece. It's by abstract impressionist Willem de Kooning, and it remained missing until 2017. And that's when an antiques collector in New Mexico got it as part of an estate, returned it immediately. It was restored over several years at the Getty Center in Los Angeles. It was, again, badly damaged, lots of cracks. But that brings us back here to Tucson today, here at the UA Museum of Art. The piece is finally back home. She even gets her own room. The public will be able to see her starting this weekend and the exhibit will be open until May. It's uh, titled Woman Ochre and it's all about the story of uh, the restoration and, and what led to this moment 37 years after that theft. So coming up at 4.30, we will be back. We'll have a little bit of a, a, a press conference we're going to do at 3.30 with a panel talking about what got us to this point. And we'll dip into that with uh, some of the dignitaries' comments. But then at 4.30, we'll go back through the whole story of what got us to this day. Valerie? Hi, Brooke. What a great